Here at the festival, the energy and excitement is definitely mounting just days ahead of the Kentucky Derby. It is a city. I know it's a little gloomy, but you can't take away from the Derby no matter what. In celebration. Yes. Boo, fun, and whatever else goes on. Just three days before the famed Kentucky Derby returns to Churchill Downs with no COVID capacity restrictions. Derby Day, we're going to Hillbilly Outfield. I'm going to go spend time with my sisters, with my mom also, and then we're probably going to bet on horses over there. We're going to be in my dad's uh, club, the T9 Club, and we're going to do a lot of, uh, and the family comes in town, we barbecue and do all of that. The traditions before the run for the roses are in full swing downtown. Even though it's a two-minute race, it's a, it's a great two-week celebration. On Wednesday night, the great steamboat race. It's been so long since we came out and we've never seen the steamboat race in person. We were like, hey, let's might as well come out. Let's have a good time today. With his mom and sisters, Lenny Garcia watched the boats make their way down the Ohio River. A slow process, but of course, in a challenge, they've got to go as quick as they can. This was a close race. It was a close race. Everybody saw it. The judges got together over in the tent over here. Do not let your eyes deceive you. But they did for some, and after working through some technicalities. This boat race is called the Great Steamboat Race. When the Bell of Cincinnati crossed the finish line first, it still didn't make the cut, and... The Bell of Louisville is the year 2022 winner of the Great Steamboat Race. And his attendees listened and danced to the music coming from the chow wagon stage well into the night, an opportunity. Meet other people and see all the different ethnicities that Louisville in general just has. And showcase a more normal Derby Week experience that we haven't seen in two years and what makes the Derby City so special. It hurts um, spiritually, you know, in the sides of Kentucky, you know. So this is, horses is everything that we are and what we do. Um, just being able to come back to the thing that we're known for is, uh, it really brings a good state of pride. Reporting in Louisville, Gladys Bautista, WOKY News.